Hi, Stacey. Thanks so much for being here with me today. You know, sustainability is a topic that's so important, and I'm really excited to hear from you on this topic today. No, I'm excited to join you as well. This is a this is a hot topic, of course, but a very important one for HP. Absolutely, and HP has made a long-term commitment to sustainability. Your goal of being the most sustainable and just technology company and creating technology that makes life better for everyone everywhere. Both those things just really resonate with me. It's such an incredible aspiration. Can you tell us more about it? Sure, um, I, I think the key thing is sustainability is a much broader topic than just uh, planet. So we've really uh, divided it up into three pillars. There's community, people, and of course planet. Uh, as we look at it, we obviously have two parts to this. How can we better the planet and how can we better others on the planet? So that's where community and people come in uh, into play. And so we're looking at it as a, a very broad approach to really changing the world. I love this. At Microsoft, we also have really big sustainability goals. We've actually been carbon neutral since 2012 and we aim to be carbon negative by 2030. I just think it's so incredible to be part of this massive effort. It's really clear to me that as more companies in our industry put real and meaningful measures in place around sustainability, everybody benefits. It's also a really big win for our customers because they get products that they can feel great about. But of course, all of this requires a big shift in both thinking and culture. I'd love to hear about your role and vision as the global head of design and sustainability at HP. Sure. Um, so a couple of things. One is we are a company that is both PC and print. So the first thing that we should probably address is our forest and how we are looking to basically not just be a, a focus on recyclability or recycled paper or content like that. It's actually to grow the forest of the world. So we, we don't want to deplete, we wanna add. The approach on the PC side is kind of twofold. One is we started a few years ago really driving an approach where we're putting recycled content into the PC, but also being mindful that the content that we add is recyclable. So you want to have that circular economy, if you will, on the material that's employed. So as we look at the products within the PC side, is we will continue over the coming years to grow that portfolio. I mean, we're already at 100% of our products in 21 as we go into 22 that contain recycled content. But what you have to think about is as we go further, we want to make sure we increase the loading of recycled content so that we're making the products more functional, more purposeful. And then when we start to think about the circular side is it's more than just adding recycled content. It's about making sure that the products themselves can last longer, be more energy efficient, and at the end actually can be reused and repurposed. So at each step along the way, whether it's recycled content, energy usage, forest, our community, our people, we're being super transparent so that everyone in the industry knows. And you're seeing that within the trade publications, you saw that just recently in a few announcements, it could be Newsweek and others, where you're seeing, uh, I think, a, a good acknowledgement of HP's push of changing the planet. There's so many great things in there. One of the things I really love about what you're doing is that HP is manufacturing from ocean-bound plastics, mm -hmm. which is actually boosting efforts to clean oceans and beaches. Can you talk more about your latest products and the benefits for customers? So I'm happy to announce at CES this year, we'll have the Elite Dragonfly Gen 3. So this is a brand new Elite Dragonfly. And what I love that uh, we've done with this is it's gone beyond just ocean bound plastics. So within the HP Elite Dragonfly, we will have the ocean bound plastics, of course, but then we will have recycled magnesium. So this is, allows us to be more circular in our approach on material, uh, even to the point where the keycaps that are used in the design are actually made up of old CDs ground up and repurposed. You'll see a number of products that are really being quite smart in the materials that we're employing and being certainly very responsible for the planet uh, as we go forward. 
Uh, it's been so great to talk to you today, Stacey. Thank you so much for joining me. Thank you very much.